As if you're looking for ROG base room for admin noted users, here's a room available for you which is a MIUI ROG edition, MIUI 12.2 away X ROG edition by Farhan 20.10.15 which right now I've installed it on my Redmi Note 8 which is Gingo. It's a ported room so can be installed on a device which is Gingo only. Don't install it on any other device because that will hard break your device of course if you use Redmi Note 8T but it's better to use Redmi Note 8 only it's available the link for this build is in the description and which other things you get here and is it really good is it really smooth to install it as a daily driver or use it as a daily driver i'm going to show you a lot of things regarding that so let's get started guys first of all the thing i think that you might notice that this navigation bar pill here which was just gone or almost the latest versions of this build of from mi y12 of this xiaomi eu or you can say the redmi note 8 device we don't get this kind of navigation pill there but yes the navigation pill is available here not actually by default you can enable it by using a flashable zip the link for that file is in the description you can go ahead and install that swiping right we have this new cool looking app vault which looks really impressive you can see almost everything is fine here we have the today step options screen time innovation for everyone a lot more things this looks really impressive you have a lot of things from ROG device but I was looking for some customizations by the way but I didn't got any customizations you can see here if you go to the lock screen customizations we have the sleep and a little bit of things like from all MIUI 12 base rooms out there display has a little bit of things like the adding color scheme text size and font weight and little bit of things like that sound and vibration also if you go for the notifications and control center we have the option to customize the control center style here by using the old version or you can use a new version also by switching the control center side if you want to switch the control center side your control center will be open from this side right now if you don't switch by default it will be from the right side top right side as you already know about that you can switch these kind of things so a little bit of things are available there home skin also have the little bit of customizations as expected wallpaper themes and also if you go for the wallpapers we have system wallpapers as 24 wallpapers looks really impressive geometry and yes we have ROG wallpapers available only four raw ROG dynamic and other are nine ROG wallpapers available there so if you want to try out these wallpapers you can easily try them if you want to also we have these dynamic wallpapers also so if you're a dynamic wallpapers level you can go for dynamic wallpapers also this was not available in the previous versions by the way we only had the ROG wallpapers but now we have the ROG dynamic wallpapers so that looks impressive including that we also have the super wallpapers and as always I'll not recommend you to use the super wallpapers at all because of some reasons you know already about that other things are quite same wallpapers themes if you go for the theme store let me show you by going into my themes we have these kind of things available the theme store looks kind of the same thing if you go for the my themes we have this color os 7.1 hydrogen ui and rog theme these are the themes which are pre-installed so if you're looking for these kind of things you can simply apply them by clicking on apply directly from here and you will see color os theme will be applied to your device can't combine always on display with themes on device so yes always on display have some issues you can see my status bar is now changed here so if we go back and go back let's try out the thing which we have right now we have almost everything is changed as you can see this is the color os theme available here which looks really impressive we have these kind of icons like the color os so you can change these kind of things are pre-installed and if you go for the settings now you can see these are also changed here so these three themes are also pre-installed which is quite impressive you can see there hydrogen ui is also pre-installed including the rog theme so if you want this rog theme on a device you can try that this theme looks really impressive how about this color os 7 yes we have this themed also control center is themed here too with this color os 7.1 theme i think you've already watched my color os 7 ported room for admin note 8 users you can install that one too if you want real color os right now on a device password and security have no issues also i didn't got any issues here at all let me show you by going into password and security screen lock fingerprint i don't use the face lock by the way other things apps more you already know about that special feature 
features include the video toolbox, game turbo, floating window, second space, kit space, etc. So if you want these kind of things, you can simply use them. Including that, we also have the floating window option available there. So if you want to try your floating windows options like this, you can simply use that. That looks really impressive. You can simply choose whatever else you want to try out. There are a lot of things to do. These were the things which you get in ROG, latest ROG build available for Redmi Note 8 users. And I have tried a lot of things. These were perfectly fine here. I didn't got any major issues till now, by the way. And if you want to install that, the link for this build is in the description alongside with the installation step so you will not face any issues i think i believe that so this is all from today's video regarding this short and simple review about rog edition room you already know about which other things you get in rog edition rooms so i don't think so since to show all those things once again then now this was all thanks for watching goodbye